we continue to explore horror this Halloween season, I wanted to throw our gaming enthusiasts a treat and offer up my top 10 horror video games to play during this spooky season. Before we begin, make sure to let me know what video game kept you up all night, and while doing so, I'd appreciate it if you like and subscribe for future content. It really helps out the channel. With that, let's begin. Number 10, Silent Hill. Silent Hill is a survival horror game developed by Konami and directed by Kichiro Toyama. The game's plot revolves around the protagonist, Harry Mason, who is searching for his adopted daughter, Cheryl, in the mysterious and eerie town of Silent Hill. The story begins with Harry and Cheryl driving to Silent Hill for a vacation, but their car crashes and Cheryl goes missing. Harry awakens to find himself on the outskirts of Silent Hill, covered in dense fog, as he sets out to find Cheryl. As he explores the town, he encounters bizarre and terrifying creatures, experiences strange supernatural phenomena, and discovers that the town is shrouded in darkness and mystery. Our game's plot unravels to reveal the presence of a dark cult known as the Order of Valtiel and their attempts to summon a malevolent deity. Silent Hill has a nightmarish alternate dimension that manifests characters' fears and guilt, known as the Otherworld. Harry's search for Cheryl leads him through both the normal and Otherworld versions of Silent Hill, Silent Hill is renowned for its atmospheric tension, psychological horror, and innovative use of fog and darkness to create a sense of unease and dread. It introduced players to a survival horror experience that focused on the psychological horror and suspense rather than constant action. The game's puzzles and multiple endings added depth to its replayability. Silent Hill had a significant influence on the horror game genre, inspiring other titles to adopt its unsettling atmosphere, environmental storytelling, and challenging puzzles. It also spawned a successful franchise with numerous sequels, spin-offs, and adaptations in various media, cementing its place as a classic in the world of horror video games. The game's dark and mysterious narrative and its iconic siren warning players of imminent danger have left a lasting mark on the horror gaming landscape. Number 9. Parasite Eve Parasite Eve is an action role-playing game developed and published by Square and now Square Enix for the original PlayStation. The game is a unique blend of horror, sci-fi, and role-playing elements. It serves as a sequel to the Japanese novel of the same name, and it follows the story of Aya Brea, a New York City cop with a dark and supernatural twist. The game's plot begins at an opera house in New York City where Aya Brea is attending the performance. During the show, the entire audience spontaneously combusts, except for Aya. She confronts a woman named Melissa who possesses extraordinary abilities and was responsible for the combustion incident. And the encounter triggers latent abilities within Aya, granting her powers to combat supernatural threats. Aya's investigation reveals that Melissa has transformed into a creature with incredible destructive potential, and she plans to give birth to the ultimate being, Eve, which could endanger all of humanity. Aya must confront these creatures to stop Melissa's plans. The game is known for its unique active time bar combat system, allowing real-time battle sequences with strategic options. It blends elements of horror with traditional RPG gameplay, creating a captivating and immersive experience. Parasite Eve was influential for several reasons. It combined genres in a way that was relatively rare at the time, fusing horror with RPG mechanics. The game received critical acclaim for its intriguing storyline, character development, and eerie atmosphere. It also marked Square's transition into a broader range of game genres beyond traditional turn-based RPGs setting the stage for titles like the Kingdom Hearts series and the Final Fantasy franchise's evolving gameplay. Parasite Eve contributed to the growth of the survival horror genre, especially on consoles, and it inspired future games to explore the fusion of horror and role-playing elements. Overall, Parasite Eve remains a memorable title that showcased the potential for storytelling and gameplay innovation in the horror genre, and it played a significant role in shaping the video game landscape. Number 8. Manhunt. Manhunt is a stealth-based psychological horror game developed by Rockstar Games known for its edgy and controversial content. The game's plot revolves around James Earl Cash, a death row inmate who is seemingly executed by lethal injection. However, he awakens to find himself in an abandoned urban area under the control of a sadistic filmmaker, Lionel Starkweather. Starkweather forces Cash to participate in a series of real-life snuff film killings, with Cash's survival dependent on his ability to follow Starkweather's instructions and execute various gang members and criminals while avoiding detection. Throughout the game, Cash communicates with Starkweather who guides and taunts him as he progresses through the grim and violent scenarios. As the game unfolds, Cash faces increasingly dangerous and disturbing situations. The game's narrative explores themes of voyeurism, violence, and moral ambiguity as players must decide how they want to approach each kill with gruesome executions or most stealthy takedowns. Manhunt was a highly controversial game upon its release, drawing criticism for its graphic violence and portrayal of brutal killings. 
It was banned or censored in several countries, and it ignited debates about video game content, censorship, and age restrictions. The game's impact on the industry was significant as it challenged the boundaries of what could be depicted in video games and raised questions about the psychological effects of violent media. While it remains a cult classic among some gamers for its intense and unsettling atmosphere, Manhunt also serves as a notable example of the ongoing discussions surrounding video game violence and censorship. And despite the controversies, it found its audience and it found a following. Number 7. Darkwood This is a top-down survival horror game developed by Acid Wizard Studio. The game is known for its atmospheric and psychological horror elements, offering players a unique and unsettling experience. The plot of Darkwood centers around an unnamed protagonist referred to as The Doctor, who finds themselves trapped in a mysterious and malevolent forest in a nightmarish world. The forest is teeming with grotesque creatures and supernatural phenomena, and the player must navigate this hostile environment to survive. As a doctor, players are tasked with scavenging for resources, crafting essential items, and uncovering the secrets of the forest. The game's story unfolds through exploration and interactions with the forest's bizarre inhabitants, who each have their own stories and struggles in this dark and oppressive world. What sets Darkwood apart is its focus on the psychological aspects of horror. The game uses limited visibility in an eerie soundscape to create a pervasive sense of dread. It leaves players in a constant state of uncertainty as the forest layout changes each playthrough, making it difficult to predict what horrors may lie ahead. Darkwood is celebrated for its unconventional approach to horror. It abandons the jump scares and action-driven horror that many games rely on and instead delivers a slow-burning, atmospheric experience that gets under the player's skin. The game's narrative is open-ended and relies on player exploration and observation allowing for multiple interpretations of its stories. Darkwood received critical acclaim for its unique approach to horror, and it resonated with players who approached its psychological and immersive elements. It also became a cult favorite among fans of the horror genre who were looking for a game to challenge traditional horror conventions. The game has had a lasting impact by inspiring other indie developers to explore the potential of psychological horror in gaming, as well as the creation of unsettling and atmospheric experiences that focus on storytelling through environmental details and player interpretation. Number 6. Dead Space This survival horror game developed by EA Redwood Shores, later known as Visceral Games, and published by Electronic Arts, the game is set in a dark and dystopian future and is known for its terrifying atmosphere and innovative gameplay. Dead Space follows Isaac Clark, an engineer who is part of a rescue team sent to investigate the USG Ishimura, a massive mining ship that has mysteriously gone silent. Upon arriving, the team discovers that the ship's crew has been slaughtered, and the Ishimura is overrun by grotesque reanimated creatures known as necromorphs. The game's plot revolves around Isaac's quest to find his girlfriend, Nicole, who is part of the Ishimura's medical team. As Isaac explores the decaying and blood-soaked ship, he encounters horrifying creatures and uncovers the dark secrets behind the necromorph outbreak, which are tied to a mysterious alien artifact known as the Marker. Throughout the game, Isaac uses improvised weapons, engineering tools, and his technical skills to dismember the necromorphs and survive. The impact of Dead Space on the horror genre and gaming in general was substantial. It was praised for its intense atmospheric horror, which was a departure from traditional survival horror games. The game introduced strategic dismemberment, requiring players to strategically sever limbs from necromorphs rather than relying on headshots, adding depth to the combat. The game's sound design, eerie ambience, and psychological tension contributed to its terrifying atmosphere. It was lauded for its exceptional world building and storytelling, drawing players into the dark and twisted lore of the Dead Space universe. The success of Dead Space led to the creation of a franchise that included two sequels, animated films, novels, and spin-off media. The game's impact on the horror genre and gaming industry is undeniable as it revitalized survival horror and inspired many other titles to embrace the psychological horror and innovation in gameplay. Dead Space became a classic in the horror genre and remains beloved by fans for its chilling atmosphere and its influence on subsequent horror games that sought to capture the same sense of dread and tension. Number 5. The Resident Evil 4 Remake From Capcom, this game aims to modernize and reimagine the classic survival horror game Resident Evil 4 which was originally released in 2005. The game is part of Capcom's efforts to revisit and revitalize its iconic Resident Evil series. Resident Evil 4 follows Leon S. Kennedy, a U.S. government agent, as he is sent to a rural village in Spain to rescue the U.S. president's daughter, Ashley Graham, who has been kidnapped by a mysterious cult known as Los Illuminados. As Leon investigates, he discovers that the villagers have been infected with a parasitic organism known as Las Plegas, turning them into aggressive and grotesque creatures. The story takes players through a series of tense encounters, 
terrifying villages, dark caverns, and a foreboding castle as Leon unravels a sinister conspiracy involving biological experiments and a charismatic cult leader, Osmond Sadler. The game's impact is significant. As Resident Evil 4 is considered one of the greatest video games of all time, it revolutionized the survival horror genre with its over-the-shoulder camera perspective, dynamic action, and iconic third-person shooter gameplay. The game introduced many elements that are now staples in the Resident Evil series, such as the inventory management system and the quick time events. The remake updates the game with modern graphics and gameplay while retaining the core elements that made the original so beloved. It brought the iconic story and gameplay of Resident Evil 4 to a new generation of gamers and rekindled the nostalgia for longtime fans. The game's impact extended to discussions about how classic titles can be adapted to modern gaming standards while staying true to the essence of the original. Number 4. Friday the 13th The Game This is a multiplayer horror game developed by Elphonic and published by Gun Media. The game is based on the iconic Friday the 13th film franchise and aims to recreate the tension and fear associated with the series. The game's plot draws from inspiration from the films and takes place at Camp Crystal Lake. Players can take on one of two roles, either a camp counselor or Jason Voorhees, the relentless and iconic antagonist. The counselors must survive the night by working together, repairing vehicles, calling for help, or hiding from Jason. Meanwhile, Jason's goal is to hunt down and eliminate the counselors in gruesome ways. Each match is a cat and mouse chase where teamwork, strategy, and careful decision making are crucial for the counselor's survival. Jason, on the other hand, has various abilities and tools at his disposal, making him a formidable adversary. The game captures the essence of the Friday the 13th films with counselors facing fear, suspense, and the relentless pursuit of the supernatural killer. Friday the 13th The Game was developed as a labor of love for fans of the film franchise. It successfully recreates the atmosphere and tension of the movies, provides a thrilling and immersive experience for the players. While it faced mixed reviews and had its share of bugs and issues, it was celebrated for its dedication to the fan service and its authenticity in translating the source material into a video game. The game's impact lies in its ability to capture the spirit of the films and the thrill of being chased by an iconic slasher villain. Not only can you play the game, but by doing so you can learn about and be immersed into the mythos of the Friday franchise with countless Easter eggs and countless callbacks to the films. It has become a cult favorite among fans for the Friday the 13th franchise and it stands as a unique multiplayer horror experience. Number three, Silent Hill 2. Silent Hill 2 is a psychological horror video game and a follow-up to the original Silent Hill. Developed by Konami and directed by Masashi Tsubayama, the game's plot takes place in the enigmatic town of Silent Hill and follows the main character, James Sunderland, who receives a letter from his wife, Mary, asking him to meet her in the town. The only problem is, Mary passed away three years earlier. Driven by confusion and hope, James arrives in Silent Hill, only to find the town shrouded in dense fog and plunged into darkness. He encounters strange, monstrous creatures as he begins his quest to uncover the mystery behind Mary's letter and her reappearance. As James explores Silent Hill, he meets other individuals who are similarly drawn to the town, including Angela Orozco, who is searching for her mother, and Eddie Dombrowski, who seems to be running from a dark past. Together, they navigate the twisted, nightmarish versions of the town, both the eerie, fog-covered streets and the gruesome other world, filled with disturbing imagery. The story of Silent Hill 2 delves into dark psychological themes, grief, guilt, and the depths of human suffering. It masterfully creates a sense of unease and disorientation, making players question the sanity of the characters and the nature of their reality. The game is known for its emotional storytelling and the complexity of its characters, including James, who is a deeply flawed and tormented protagonist. Silent Hill 2 is considered one of the greatest horror games ever made. It's renowned for its deep, mature storytelling and complex characters, setting a high standard for psychological horror in the gaming world. The game's influence on the horror genre is profound, with many titles trying to capture the same emotional depth and psychological terror it achieved. Silent Hill 2 remains a classic in the video game industry, remembered not only for its terrifying atmosphere, but also for its exploration of human psychology and the dark recesses of the human mind. Number 2. Bioshock. Bioshock is a first-person shooter game developed by Irrational Games, now known as Ghost Story Games, and published by 2K Games. The game is set in the underwater city of Rapture and is known for its atmospheric storytelling and thought-provoking narrative. Bioshock is set in the 1960s and players take on the role of Jack, a plane crash survivor who discovers the entrance to Rapture, an isolated and what's utopian city built by Andrew Ryan. The city is now in ruins, overrun by mutated and crazed citizens due to the use of a substance called Adam, which grants superhuman abilities but drives people to madness. 
As Jack explores Rapture, he learns about its history, the conflict between Ryan and a scientist named Dr. Bridget Tenenbaum, and the power struggles among various factions in the city. The central figure in Rapture is Frank Fontaine, a ruthless businessman who controls the atom trade. The game's impact on the industry is substantial. Bioshock is celebrated for its captivating world building, intricate plot, and philosophical themes, particularly centered on Anne Rand's philosophy of objectivism. It also introduced players to a unique combat system combining firearms with genetic enhancements known as plasmids. Its approach to storytelling through environmental details and audio logs set a new standard for narrative-driven video games. Bioshock was praised for tackling mature and philosophical themes, and it initiated discussions about the capacity of video games to address complex subjects. The success of Bioshock led to two sequels and a remastered collection and it has continued to influence the gaming industry by showcasing the potential of video games as a medium for artistic and narrative expression. Bioshock remains a beloved classic that is remembered for its gripping narrative, immersive atmosphere, and impact on video game storytelling. Number 1. The Last of Us The Last of Us is an action-adventure game developed by Naughty Dog and published by Sony Computer Entertainment. It's set in a post-apocalyptic world and is known for its emotional storytelling and character development. The game is set in the year 2033. Two decades after a fungal infection has turned the majority of humanity into aggressive, zombie-like creatures known as clickers, and the world has fallen into chaos. Players assume the role of Joel, a hardened survivor who lost his daughter early in the outbreak. He is tasked with escorting Ellie, a teenage girl who may hold the key to a possible vaccine, across a treacherous and dangerous America. As Joel and Ellie embark on their journey, they face numerous challenges, including hostile human survivors, the infected, and the harsh consequences of their own actions. The game's plot delves deep into themes of loss, survival, and the complex bonds that form between the characters in the face of adversity. The story is a heart-wrenching exploration of the human condition in a post-apocalyptic setting. The Last of Us is considered a masterpiece of video game storytelling. It received critical acclaim and won numerous awards for its narrative, its character development, and its voice acting. The game resonated with players who were captivated by its emotional depth realistic characters, and moral dilemmas. It demonstrated that video games could be a medium for complex storytelling and eliciting powerful emotions. The impact of The Last of Us extended beyond its immediate success, as it influenced the gaming industry by raising the bar for narrative-driven gaming experiences and contributed to the ongoing discussions about the artistic and emotional potential of the medium. The game's success led to a highly anticipated sequel, The Last of Us Part Two released in 2020, which continued to explore the complex characters and themes of the first game. The Last of Us remains a landmark title in gaming, and it's often celebrated as one of the finest examples of video games as a form of art. And that's my list. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe for future content, and check out my other videos on the top 10 horror movies you should watch this Halloween, and my ranking of all the Friday the 13th films. Thank you for listening, and as always, I am your reluctant gringo, from south of the border, salute and a huevo.